Habakkuk's blueprint was staggering. 2,000 feet long, 300 feet wide, walls 40 feet thick. Engineers secretly built a prototype on Patricia Lake, Alberta, Canada, freezing sawdust into massive ice blocks, layering them into a hull the size of a floating city. It was part science, part madness, a miracle born from desperation. A warship made of ice, designed to change the course of the Battle of the Atlantic. Reality struck hard, ice melts. Refrigeration systems were massive, construction costs soared to 100 million pounds, and steel warships were urgently needed elsewhere. By mid-1943, sonar and escort carriers were defeating U-boats faster than Habakkuk could ever sail. The dream was big, but fragile. Ice cracks, money vanishes, priorities shift, and sometimes, even the boldest ideas must melt away. By 1944, Project Habakkuk was quietly abandoned. No ceremony, no speech, just a frozen prototype left to melt into Patricia Lake. Today, fragments remain, ghostly reminders of what could have been. A secret experiment, a vision of hope, 